So there is a good chance that right now you need to create a logo, whether it's for your business or it's for a specific product of yours. We often need logos of some kind. So in today's video, I thought I would share with you a quick and inexpensive way to DIY your own logo using Canva. Don't worry if you never designed a logo before, with this tool, you're going to be able to. So this is what it looks like when you logged in to Canva. And there is a free plan that you can use. You're gonna come over here to your search bar and then you're going to type in logo and then select this first one that appears here. From here you can click blank and this is going to open up your design file. Over here on the left, you will see all these different logo templates that you can choose and customize for your brand. So you can go through this and choose the one that you like. Okay, so let's pick one and customize it. I really like this one right here, so I'm going to click on that and then I can click on any of the elements to customize it. So for example, if I click here, the color square will appear on the top here. If you find that the elements are moving together at the same time, that means they have been grouped together. So you can come up here and click ungrouped and then you can move them around separately. So I'm going to change the colors to my brand colors. And then I can make it smaller or bigger. And then I'm going to group them together and move them around. So I can get the angle that I want. So, yeah. You can play around with this to make it look like the way you want and yeah. It's very easy, it's a good software to use, especially for beginners. So what else can I do with this? I'm going to reduce the transparency. I make it 60, 80, and 100. For the text, I can click on this and change it to my business name. So that's our business name for right now. So now turn right, can we change what the text is? We can also change the fonts. Come over here to my font section and then select the one that I'm going to use. I'm going to delete this text right here. And then play around with it to see how it's going to look like. So you can change font sizes, styles, colors, effects. So this is a really a good flexible program, guys. You can just drag and drop. Now, of course, this is more of a beginner option, so you're not going to be able to trademark this because other people will likely have this exact same thing in their logo. But I don't think that's the biggest issue. This is the great way to start on and also all of the elements you will be customizing for your brand. Also, there is a million logo variations you could make from these elements. So that is just something to keep in mind. You can always start out with something like this and then you could go to a designer in the future. But if you need something that is completely 100% unique to you and that can be trademarked, then you are going to need to hire a designer for your logo. I'm going to go with this. I think it looks good. Then to download, I'm going to click on download and I'm going to download it as a PNG and with a transparent background. So 
share have fun with these guys and make your own designs i hope you gained something from this video thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video